So we also have highlighter palette. So use this one to highlight the nose highlighter palette. Another important thing you have is the oil control palette. We have the oil control palette. Let me not forget the brush. I normally use so we have the uh, edge control, edge control glue. They have different types, so you can get any one. But I prefer this one because it's dark and um, it stays longer. So I, I should. You also need a brush. The brush I no longer use in again. So that's the best thing I use for. That's what I normally use. We need this. I only use this for my foundation. That's. I only use this for my foundation. So you can use brush or this. And that can be used for another thing too. We have eyeliner. This eyeliner, we have different types. We have different types. This is also another eyeliner. So we have different types of eyeliner. So we have this, we have this. Artificial eyelashes. So I prefer this one other than the one the face one one because this one you can easily do it at home yourself with the bond. This eyelash adhesive. So this one is we use this one for this other one. This other one. So we use this eye adhesive. This glue for this one. For this one, you don't need to use this. You don't need to use this glue. Just this bond. When if you this bond is if strong enough to fix this. And I prefer this one because you can easily pull it off oil or water. So the next one is our eyeshadow. So this also who's that gear product and it's also very good. It's also very good. So this palette is also very good. It contains 35 colors and it also has glinters for those who like glinters. So and it has so much very beautiful amazing colors so you can see you can see the colors are much so that's one that's one reason why i said i like who's that so the products are also very nice so you can see i have two or three products here and those products are very nice then also we have the um mesilla water the mesilla water is used it's used to remove makeup. I only use it to remove makeup. So some people they use it. They also use to clean their face before they apply makeup, and that's just okay. But I only use mine to remove makeup. It trapped every of the makeup out of your face, and which is very necessary because, you know, no matter how you wash your face, you will still have little remaining. We have little makeup remaining, and if you don't wash it off very well, you are you are born to break out it will just clog your pores and you break out so micellar water has to remove everything so when you are done at, at the end of the day when you're done you wipe use cut glue to wipe the makeup off with mix micellar water before you take your bath or you can take your bath take your bath then wipe you still use micellar water to clean up it's very necessary the next one i have is the face mist the face mist is used after applying makeup you just spray it on your face to it keeps the makeup for a longer time too the next thing you need a mirror you know as you are going out so you need a mirror it's necessary to have a little mirror in your bust especially for those who are doing actually makeup artists a commercial makeup artist needs a small mirror because as you are going where you go as when you get to where you want to when you get to the place when you get to your customer's place, you'll be surprised the person don't have small mirror and the person will tell you as you are applying the makeup, the person will tell you, hey, please give me a mirror, let me check. They, many many women want to do that. Many you know ladies they always want to check if you are doing what they want you to do. And if you tell them you don't have a mirror, they will look at you. they will look at you like, What? How come you don't have a mirror? They forgot that. They are, you are in their house and they are supposed to have a mirror. So make sure you have a mirror in your box. Also, your eyeliner. So, 
these extra pens I have these thick pens that's I normally use for myself anyways because you know some if you are hurrying out and you don't have time to use the palette so that's a quick one for you to use we also have mascara if the customer or the person or you you should if you don't want to face eyelashes you can go with mascara you still have those fittings so this one is a lemon loose powder i have aside the kit so the next one is your clip if maybe the person is carrying the ribbon a hair that is disturbing or the person at the object of the you want to pack the person's hair you need a clip in your box the next one is a concealer but you need different shades of concealer so this is just one concealer but sometimes if you don't have concealer if you don't want if, if you don't have concealer you can use foundation i only use foundation anyways i use foundation a lot for in place of concealer it will still go well you will still get the fitting you want so this is concealer brush yes yeah, this is concealer brush so this this concealer brush is yeah you see that's what you use to to maintain your concealer line it's very necessary very necessary so i mentioned this one for the eyeliner see how it looks like so these are secondary makeup advanced makeup if you are doing this you use all those ones if you are doing advanced makeup that's but if you are a beginner just learn how to use the basic uh, tools you might not need that as a beginner so we have eyeshadow primer is eyeshadow primer so we have lip gloss i also have another lip gloss which i even prefer this one is stronger this is actually what i'm using so when i'm rushing out sometimes or when i don't want to really make up i just apply little um i apply little of the stick lipstick I use this then I just apply this on top so another that you need as a makeup artist is your razor blade for shaving for shaving the eyebrow before you make up that's even the first thing you need to do because before you before you draw your eyeliner before you draw your eyebrow that's the first thing you're supposed to do as a makeup artist because if you don't maintain that line you have to maintain the line you have to carve the line you want you have to carve it because Many people don't know how to carve this thing at home, so they expect for you to have a very nice shape. You have to carve the person's eyebrow because if you don't carve it, no matter if, as you, when you are drawing your eye, when you are drawing, when you draw, when you draw, it will not be straight. And even if, within few minutes, the person will sweat and everything will wipe off. So the first thing is for you to carve. You have is the blush our blush the blush palette so this uses for blush it's also an advanced tool. Mm. then now that finally you need your pencil you need your your pencils you need your eyebrow pencils so this is what you use to draw you need this to draw you need this to carve your eyebrow you need it you need it then you need different shades. you need like three shade 18 number three and the dark one for for so and 18 number three and, and number one so that those are the three colors i normally use and the person the person will tell you, I don't like, you'll be surprised. And you can't just say, I. Some people will say, use 18 for fair people. Some people will say, use 30 for fair people. Some people will say, use this one for this person. So this thing is, it lies with the person's choice. Sometimes you will just be surprised that you, you think a fair person should use 18. And the person will just tell you, no, 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 I don't like 18. I want a dark color. So you have to give the person what the person wants. So that is it. 
and that's all for now and i hope you enjoyed this video please if you know you've not if you follow me to this time i'm really really grateful thank you for watching my videos thank you for always supporting me thank you for the likes for the comments for everything and please if you have any other question please draw peace in the comment section i will attend to them when i see them and follow me on my make of journey you will learn more you will learn many that's all for now and i wish you a very good day thanks for watching see you next time bye